Kevin Thomas, the change coach, Brian Smith, the Barnum War Horses coach. Year two for you. Year one's always a little bit, you know, touchy trying to get your, your culture set, your program set. How much more comfortable are you and the guys now with you as well going into year two? Man, you know, we, we talked about it the other day. Year two has been so much easier. Everything's installed. Our two, our tech, second team could play a ball game. I don't say they'll be real good at a ball game, but they know who to block. They know how to get to them. And just having, we inherited a great culture, inherited a group that really worked their tails off every day in the weight room in the off season and during the season. And so it's been really a pleasure to coach them. It's made us a lot better. You know, you kind of, had, kind of had a little bit young group last year, but had a good season, made some noise in the playoffs as well. What have you seen this all season that makes you so excited about going into the 2024 season? Our kids have changed their bodies. You know, uh, Isaac Cooper's a defense coordinator. We got him from Lawrence, young guy. He's also our strength coach. And our kids who already lifted and bought in so well, and a lot of them have changed their bodies. We had some, you know, Tony Cherry, our left tackle, was a 6'5", 300. He's probably a 315, 318-pound lineman last year. Not fat, but a little big and He's like 295 and and, and, and and looks great. Logan Sturkey, I mean, our guy, our receivers, those guys, all of our players have gotten so much stronger and they look so much better. Not they look bad, yep. but they look so much better as they get older. And they understand the sense of urgency given a uh, having one more year left to go as seniors. You mentioned a couple of those guys, but who are maybe some key players that are really going to have to be, you know, big time contributors for you guys this well, year? It all starts with us at quarterback with Cam yep. Austin. I mean, he. He's a USC uh, baseball commit, center fielder, can pitch and run. He can throw the ball. He can he can run the ball. It don't matter. We're going to go as far as he takes us. Uh, I tell him, and we give him the options. He, he has a lot of freedom in our offense. So we're going to get in the gun and let him throw the ball outside and get us out of bad plays. And He's smart enough to do it, and he's such a selfless person. He loves getting the ball to a bunch of people. But we we've all we have to teach him to be selfish sometimes and take what's if, if it's him he's got to take it. Last one, coach. Do you have any goals set yet for this upcoming season for the War Horses? Well, you know we just want to attack this day. We told our kids we think we got a chance to be really good, uh, but you know that doesn't do you any good on the scoreboard. So we're gonna go out and play great every week. And see where it gets us. Coach Brian Smith, the Barn War Horses. Best of luck, coach. Thank you, man. Appreciate, Appreciate you.